A chain, a man is in police custody after a fight turned deadly in Speedway. Police arrested 23-year-old Joseph Bryant, seen here. He is facing a preliminary charge of involuntary manslaughter. 24-hour news 8's Julian Grace joins us live in Speedway. And Julian, why is this not a murder investigation? Uh, great question, Mike. We're learning from police here that they are waiting on the Marion County Coroner's Office to determine if the victim died from natural causes or if the victim possibly died from the physical dispute that took place earlier this morning. In Speedway, murder and death investigations don't happen a lot around here. We're very fortunate. Speedway is a, is a safe town to live in and to work in. But at 4.45 in the a.m., Police were called to this house after a fight between two family members. Both were injured, both rushed to the hospital. One survived and one died. Unfortunately, in this instance, uh, we had a situation where uh, there was an altercation within a family uh, within their house. Uh, that altercation, unfortunately, led to some violence. Uh, two people were injured during the course of that. One of them, unfortunately, passed away. The one who made it. Joseph Bryant, age 23. He was arrested and charged with manslaughter. The one who died remains without ID. We don't know the victim's connection to Bryant, and at this point, police are not willing to say much more. What we do know is that this case is in the hands of the Marion County Coroner to determine the cause of death. And if foul play is discovered, charges against Bryant will likely be enhanced to murder. We want the, uh, the report from the coroner's office to help us to determine whether or not uh, there were any type of pre-existing health conditions or anything that could have been factors involved with this person passing away. Now we did check in with the investigators here. We are learning that the Marion County Coroner's Office could make a determination on the cause of death as early as tomorrow. We'll keep you posted. Any new information about this investigation, you'll be able to read about it on WishTV.com. For now, reporting live in Speedway, Julian Grace, 24-hour news Julian, thank you. New tonight.